We should call the police as soon as we can. I'm not so sure that's a good idea. We should think about where to hide this big guy. Watch out, guys. I think Ralph is sensing something. Hola. Quien ha sido? Hands up! Hands up! Him. We got them! I repeat, we got them! The Strider is down. The humans are unarmed. Don't you even move! Okay, sir. You will have to come with me. Someone wants to meet you in person. What we do with the Strider? Dismantle it. No! Also, I think we should kill this one, too. There's no need to rush. The most logical thing to do. We say he died. He died. And none of you can do anything about it. What? This is... Again. El toro. The ball! <laughs> Kids! What the hell are you doing here? Me? I had to do some business in these woods. But I have some better questions. What the hell are you doing here? Is she your friend? Who the hell were those two uniform guys? Why'd they have blue blood? What the hell is that big ugly robot thing? Is that the alien you were talking about? It's a long story. I believe you. We better move. I bet my ass these guys have friends and they'll be here soon. My truck is nearby. Let's go. We gotta disappear. Okay. So... This washing machine came from outer space. Yes. We are not really sure where this thing came from. It fell from the sky, that's for sure. But there are other aliens that look like people. Yeah. That are trying to kill him. And you. Yes. And her. Yes. Who are you again? My name is Linda. I'm a reporter. Okay, so there is this conspiracy of aliens that are plotting something. I don't like how that sounds. I've already planned my vacations. Where are you going on vacation? To Hawaii, of course. I want to practice some surfing. Can we keep the focus on the killer aliens? We have to call the police. It's not a good idea. They're everywhere. We can't trust anyone. I don't like cops, so that's okay with me. We have to learn more about those aliens before taking any action. How are we going to learn more about them? They'll try to kill us on sight. We have to stop them. How the hell are we going to know what to do? Maybe we could ask Ralph. Do you have a Ouija board? Because that thing looks pretty dead to me. No. He is still working. Right, Ralph? He is kind of in a critical condition. But I guess I could fix him. With the right tools. And those tools are? A wielding machine. And some tin to repair the circuit damage. These circuits are pretty basic for an advanced race. Also, we want to be able to communicate with this thing. So I guess a computer with a dictionary would give us the right interface to teach him how to talk to us. Are you sure you can do this? The damage looks superficial. I could give it a try. I'm sure you can do it. Besides, we don't have any other options. Okay, I'll take notes. A computer with a dictionary installed, some tin, and a welding machine. We'll go into town for those things. You better stay here guarding Ralph. Pues necesitamos eso, entonces estaño, máquina para soldar y un ordenador con un diccionario instalado. Y tenemos un mapa nuevo, tenemos el camión que es donde está Ralph, la plaza del pueblo, salida secreta, la calle comercial, calle de Samantha Silverman y calle del director Smith. 
y la entrada a New Frontier, a Nueva Frontera. Pues, como sea, ah, mira, ya a costa del río. Vamos a ir uno por uno viendo qué hay y hablando con toda la gente. It's a regular wooden bench. There is nothing particularly interesting about it. Benches are usually not that interesting. Well, maybe if you are into feeding pigeons? Hey! Hey, good morning. It's the middle of the night. Oh, yeah, it's true. Just look at the moon. Anyways, sup? What are you doing out here so late? Is it late? Yes. I'm not tired at all. I'm just walking around. Have you seen something unusual? Well, I've seen a lot of stuff lately. Did you hear something about the New Frontier Corporation? Yes. Suddenly the New Frontier Labs are full of guards. I hear that someone set their self planes labs on fire. Are you... on something? Yes, I'm on Super Lemon Cola. Man, that's the best thing ever. It really quenches the thirst. How many cans did you drink already? Like... 20? Bye! Bye, bye, bye! This year, North Forest Christmas tree is even bigger. Those are a lot of tax dollars invested on a tree no one is going to benefit from. Come on, where's your Christmas spirit? I like Christmas. I just don't approve government spending on magical conifers. There are no gifts under that tree. Hey, the bottom of the well is full of coins! Vamos a necesitar pescar alguna alguna de las monedas para algo. There's another way to get to the bottom. Well, in fact, I heard that the North Forest urban design is so badly planned that they ruined the water well by connecting it with the city drains. So, there is our chance. The bottom is full of coins, but I can't reach them. There's a big fall. Y estas tres chicas de sup ah, el super lemon cola es lo que se ha bebido el niño este. Hello, hey guys, ready for the freshness and irresistible taste of super lemon cola. What are you doing so late at night in the square? Sharing the incredible taste of Super Lemon Cola! With whom? This place is dead at this time of night. That only makes our job easier. Besides, thanks to the delicious caffeine of Super Lemon Cola, who can sleep at night? Legal disclaimer. Caffeine may or may not be delicious. Super Lemon Cola could cause insomnia, paranoia, and other sleepiness-associated problems. Are there any Super Lemon Cola free samples? You're in luck tonight. We have a great promotion. Legal disclaimer, the promotion could be not great. If you bring us any other can of soda that you're drinking, we'll trade it in for a brand new can of Super Lemon Cola. It's the Lemon Cola Trade or Garbage Challenge. It's Super Lemon Cola or Garbage. Legal disclaimer, you could have more options in life than Super Lemon Cola or Garbage. Tell me more about Super Lemon Cola. The Lemon Cola Company was established in 1886 by John Lemon Cola an Irish immigrant who wanted to create the ultimate rust buster. Legal disclaimer, Super Lemon Cola may or may not be a rust buster. John Lemon Cola may or may not be a real person. And the allegations of the Lemon Cola Corporation financing military dictatorships in some countries of South America could be non-factual. We didn't reach that part yet. You better stop there then. Have you seen anything unusual tonight? I saw a raccoon jumping on a pogo stick. Legal disclaimer, consuming Super Lemon Cola over long periods of time may cause hallucinations. Goodbye. Vale, pues necesitamos una lata 
para dárselo y que nos den una lemon cola que parece que quita el óxido. Y el que se ha bebido 20 es el niño este, así que a lo mejor no da una lata vacía. Hey. Yeah. Are you on some Yeah, me. Esto ya no lo sabemos, 20 y nada, no nos dice nada nuevo. Dice que ha consumido 20, pero nada más. Vale, parece ser que el pozo está conectado. Anda, y este está conectado con las alcantarillas o con el sistema de agua. No las alcantarillas, sino el sistema de agua del, del pueblo. There was a fire here not long ago. The barrel is still hot. The tent is dirty and smells like a mix of wine, pizza and vomit. That's probably what you are smelling. The barrel is still hot. Also, it is too big and dirty. Habrá aquí una lata. This shopping cart is full of creepy things. It has dolls, red summer lipstick, a jar of some green jam, some rotten onions, and a lot of bags and old newspapers. Stop looking at my stuff! You touch that, and I cut you! Don't worry, we are not touching anything! Hello! I can't believe it! River goblins! We are not. Oh, otro que dice que somos people mistaking us goblins. goblins. We aren't that short, right? Uh, let's roll with it. Hello, little goblins! Have you seen something unusual tonight? Yes! The evil river crocodile. Keep an eye on him or he will eat you alive. Or worse, he will drink your booze. That doesn't look like. I can distinguish an evil crocodile when I see one, and I'm watching one right now. But it looks like it's just a crocodile. But if you slay him, I'll give you a prize. Okay. You can scare a snake, you can bribe a wolf, but you can't ever defeat a crocodile. Can you help us? Help you do what? There's a blue-blooded race of human replicant aliens that are invading our planet. Can you help us stop them? <laughs> I don't know what you've been drinking, but man, I want some. But we're telling the truth. Sorry, you are talking crazy stuff. I bet you are trying to confuse me with one of your goblin riddles. Why are you here? The weather is nice. Maybe you can find a terrifying monster from time to time, like the evil crocodile. But you also can find invaluable prizes in the riverbank. Yesterday, I found half a tuna sandwich. Fascinating. Do you like tuna sandwiches? Yes. Then stay away from my riverbank or I cut you. We have to go. Goodbye, little goblins. Y nada más. Is that a crocodile? What would a crocodile be doing here? Well, crocs are known to be very adaptive. That's not a crocodile. I'm almost positive it's just debris. Anyone want to touch that? Nope. No. I'm sure it's not a croc, but what if there's a spider in there and it bites me? Vale, siguiente. Eh, la calle de Samantha Silverman. A ver si encontramos algo interesante. Let's see what we got here. Cool. A really short hose. No wonder they threw this away. Vale, tenemos algo. 
Una manguera corta. The door is locked. It's clearly out of reach. We have to find a way to get her attention. I can throw stones. No, I know you. You're going to end up breaking a window. What if we hold a boombox above her head and play music? That will call the attention of the whole neighborhood. We should find a way to send her signals in a more discreet way. This car looks awesome! It is awesome! This is a Mustang GT! Man, this thing has a V8 engine! It's locked. Cerrado. Como no. It's a Christmas tree. This is probably a Hanukkah bush. What's the difference? Mainly the name. There are no presents under this tree. Two bears saying, Happy Hanukkah. What the hell is Hanukkah? It's Jewish Christmas! It's a totally different celebration. But it's on the same day as Christmas! It depends. Hanukkah starts the 25th of Kishlev. Okay, now you're just inventing words. Un DeLorean. The classiest time-traveling machine ever created! People in this neighborhood must be loaded. Estaba cerrado, ¿no? The club. It's locked. Of course it is. This thing costs a fortune. Pues de aquí solo hemos sacado la manguera corta y que tenemos que llamar la atención de Samantha de alguna manera. Calle del director. ¿Qué será este, supongo? Hi, kids. Isn't it kind of late for you to be so far away from home? That's none of your business. Uh, fair enough. What are you doing? I'm beholding the vastness of the universe. Isn't that telescope pointing at Miss Perez's house? No! <clears throat> not at all! Don't worry, we're not here to judge you. I'm a creep. Vinny likes Samantha Silverman, but he'll never tell her. Hey! And Tony supposedly freezes when he likes a girl. That was a secret. It's not a secret, it's something stupid. Don't worry, it's nothing to be ashamed of, you know. I have the same problem. How did you solve it? By drinking like this. That was just terrible advice right there. Man, I miss Mrs. Perez. Why don't you go and talk to Mrs. Perez? I wouldn't know what to tell her. Wasn't the alcohol supposed to help you with that? Yeah, but... I mean... Why would she give me another chance? Just give me a reason and I'll finish this beer and go straight to her door. Vale, tenemos que convencerlo para que beba la cerveza, deje la lata, y supongo que esa lata es la que nos sirve para que no den eh, la limonada. O la limon cola esta. She should give you another chance because you are the principal. Yeah, and she is a teacher, so... No, no, no. That kind of logic is what made us break up in the first place. Can we use your telescope? No, it's mine. But... No, I'm using it. Why don't you go and talk to Mrs. Perez? I wouldn't know what to tell her. Wasn't the alcohol supposed to help you with that? Yeah, but... I mean... Why would she give me another chance? Just give me a reason and I'll finish this beer and go straight to her door. 
She should give you another chance because you are a cool dude. You think I'm cool? Um... I'm not an expert on this subject, but I don't think that argument is going to hold that much water. Can we enter your house? What? Why? No! Just asking. Why don't you go and talk to Mrs. Perez? Ah, uh, what? Be just... She should give you another chance because she is ugly. Wow. That's like <laughs> the worst way to. Esto no va a funcionar. Besides, she is beautiful. But maybe if she is insecure enough. Oh, man. You guys are the worst. I guess it's my fault for asking for this kind of advice from teenagers. Bye. Goodbye, kids. Vale, tenemos que convencerlo de alguna manera. The door is closed. It's closed and locked. We... No, that could draw some unnecessary attention. Bueno, la ventana. Ah, parece por el otro lado, pero bueno, vamos a ir corriendo. Puerta ventana. The window door is closed and locked. Can we force our way in by breaking the glass door? No, that could be troublesome on so many levels. Y usando la tarjeta otra vez, no creo, ¿no? It's not like that cares. Vale, vamos a la calle comercial. A ver qué nos encontramos por aquí. Jackpot. This thing has credits on it. It has man credits. What does that mean? It's an error. Errors. They make life so sweet. Yo tengo partidas infinitas. Vale, aquí no puedo hacer nada, ni siquiera usar ningún objeto, así que lo único que se puede hacer aquí es usar la máquina. Te mueve poco a poco. Pues no sé, quizás haya que hacerle algo. I'd rather not. This is a game about fighting llamas. It makes little sense. Cráneo de serpiente. Hey! I'm trying to play here. It seems like you are losing. It ain't my fault. This game is super hard. Yeah, it looks hard. What are you playing? Monkey Kong. Is it good? Yeah, but it's kind of unfair. Then why do you play it? I like it. What is your highest score? 2,500. Did you beat the first level? 
Nope, never. How long have you been playing? For two weeks already. He sucks at this. So, you like rock and roll? Yeah, how do you know? The clothes? Oh, yeah. It's my lost guy's uniform, you know. Mind if I give it a try? Are you crazy? Wait your turn. How many coins do you have left? A lot. Did you know? What? You have to jump the barrels. Thanks for the advice, asshole. Did you know? What? If you destroy the blue barrels, they give you extra points. I noticed. Did you know? What? There are easier games. What are you trying to say? Nothing, nothing. Vale, pues ya está. Goodbye. <laughs> No he sacado nada de aquí. Okay. A lo mejor hay que hacer que, que deje de jugar de alguna manera. It's a talking capsule toy vending machine. When I was a little kid, I lost so much money in this guy. This one is already out of toys. The object of the game is to collect as many points as possible by having the ball fall into holes in the rings, which have progressively increasing point values. I'm really good at this one. If you want some tickets, just let me play this game. Well, usar los huevos de alguien como bolas? No, verdad? No. I'd rather not. No. Vale, esta tiene alicate. Será algún tipo de regalo si ganas en alguna de las máquinas. Hi, welcome to Laser Llamas, where the fun begins. I would like to buy some coins. Alrighty then, they cost a quarter each. How many do you want? How about you loan us some coins? No, but we can pay you with a 15% interest rate. No. Are you familiar with the French system of amortization? Cash only. What can I get with tickets? You can get... Do you like pincers? Maybe. The only thing we have right now is this pair of end cutters for 200 tickets. What happened to all the cool prizes? Can you keep a secret? Yes. Me too. Vale, a lo mejor Bye. el dinero que está dentro Goodbye. del pozo sirve para comprar tickets. Hello. Hello. You guys are not from here, right? No, we are from South Plains. <laughs> I knew it. What are you doing so far away from your shitty town? Well, we're not really far away. I mean, South Plains is just next to North Forest. And our town is not that shitty. Why do you all dress the same? We are a team. The official North Forest Street Puncher team. The most radical street puncher team ever! With Kyle as our opener. That's right! Otto, the master of round two. No one can beat me! And me, Benji, the final challenger and captain of the North Forest Punchers! Do you play street puncher in South Plains? Maybe. I bet my team can beat your team any day of the week! In your dreams. When we work together, nothing can stop us. What do you want to bet? I bet you all my arcade tickets against... Do you have some game tokens? No. How do you plan to play? I don't know. Get some game tokens and you have a challenge. How do Street Hunter challenges work? Well, we bet something. In our case, our arcade tickets against a few game tokens you might have. No bet, no fun! You sound like my uncle. He is a compulsive gambler. 
Then we do three one versus one matches. The team that wins three out of the three times wins the challenge. Otherwise, it's a tie, and no one loses nor wins anything. We call it the perfect policy. You win every match, or you don't truly win. Now you sound like my aunt. She's a perfectionist. Do you have any tips for Street Puncher? <laughs> What's so funny? Really? Come on! We are not giving away our secrets to South Planners. Do you have some extra arcade tokens to spare? No, we are planning on using them. But what if... Now, as my mom used to say, all people from South Plains are freeloaders. Did you see something unusual tonight? A guy stole all the wooden balls from the ski ball. We are almost certain he was from South Plains. That was yesterday. Really? How long have we been here? Like... 72 hours. I'm not sure. See you later. Bye. No hace falta las monedas del pozo. I can't open this with my bare hands. There is no handle. No hay picaporte. That It's not ya está. Pues necesitamos el dinero. A whole movie rack dedicated to Broken Circuit. I like the movie, but I don't think it's that popular. Hello! Hello, Palinchinski. Welcome to Tape Store. Palinchinski? Palinchinski, Palinchinski. Children. Hello, children. <laughs> Welcome to Tape Store. Uh oh! Thanks. We want to rent a movie. Good. What movie you want? You always want to see old movies. Let me choose something better. No, no, no. This is my turn. It was Vinny, Nick, Tony. Last week it was Nick's turn. Now it's my turn. I will choose the movie. The Cabinet of Dr. Caligari. Oh, great choice. It's $5. Now that I think about it, I won't be renting this one. Okay. Goodbye! Paderinka! Este será el ordenador que nos hace falta. Instalado con... Con el traductor que nos hace falta. No me extrañaría nada. The door is closed. That doesn't have number six bolts. Here is where the adult movies are. We should definitely go there. Seems like it's closed. Man, that sucks. Vale, nos queda la entrada de New Frontier. Do you think Ralph's laser can pierce through that? First, we repair the robot, then we test what we can pierce. Fair enough.
Okay. Trash, 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 and more trash. Are you sure there is nothing semi-useful there? Keep in mind that our standards for usefulness are very low. No, it's just trash. Like rotting things and smelly stuff. Oh, wait! Hey! Look, it's a small fryer basket! Rad! Really? We are saying rad to an old fryer basket. I feel like a hobo already. Well, at least it doesn't stink. It does stink. Tenemos una freidora. ¿Para qué? No lo sé. Más lobo. I bet he came here attracted by the sense of blood. Go away! There's nothing else to eat here! Shut up! What if he decides to try and eat us? I grab. No, no get it. I grab. Vale, pues vamos al camión a ver si hay algo interesante dentro. This is not a motorcycle. This is a legend. The bull loves her. Aneta, she saved my life so many times. It's okay where it is right now. May I? No. No. But... No. We already... No. Look, you're too young to handle those things. Believe me, I've seen this before. You are going to end up shooting one of your friends by mistake. Please don't. Why? What does this do? That turns on the truck's battle mode. Hey, that sounds awesome! Let's do that! No, we have to keep our profile low. For now. Uf, pues... Ya lo he visto todo. A ver, la freidora esta. What could a fire basket do there? Servirá con algo de aquí. What could a fire basket do there? Pues no. Y con el agua. What could a fire basket do there? What could have... Vale. Pues nada. What could have... El niño... Ah, yo decía, el niño se ha ido. What could a... Nope. Ah, esto no lo había visto. Instalación abandonada.
This is a lost guy's hideout. Go do your nerd stuff somewhere else. Says who? Says me, Furio. But we are lost guys! Really? Then tell me the lost guy's secret password. I don't remember it? That's not the password. Sometimes you have to play with the cards you are dealt. That's also not the password. I mean, don't worry, we will recall it. Eventually. Can we pass? No, this place is Lost Guys only. But we are Lost Guys. Okay, prove it. What is the Lost Guys gang password, bozo? Open Sesame! No. Get lost! What are you doing here? None of your business. Is this a vampire gathering? What? No. Is there anything here that would be helpful to fix a broken alien? What? What? What kind of question was that? What question? Forget it. Can we pass? No, this place is Lost Guys only. But we are Lost Guys. Okay, prove it. What is the Lost Guys gang pass? There's no time for this. Aliens are taking over the world. No, get lost. Vale, voy a probar. Can we? No. Okay. What? What is the password? Hay que probarlo todo, por si acaso. The password is. Oh, <laughs> Casi. nice try. The password is, oh, nice try? No. <laughs> Can we pass? No. Oh. Okay. What is... Black is the new black. No. We have to go. Get lost. Was that an invitation to join the Lost Guys? Go away already. Ah, necesitamos la clave para pasar. Eh, este que está aquí... No será uno de los niños perdidos, esto. Hey! What? Mind if I give it a try? Are you crazy? Wait your turn! How many coins do you have left? Well, did you? Ah. There are easy... Nothing! Did... Nah, esto está todo. There... Nothing! Give... Oh. A ver si hay algún sitio que no haya ido todavía. Ah, depósito de chatarra. Now you see it. Now you don't. Puede servir la llave Adelen para abrir la puerta que no tiene eh, manija para abrir. Vamos a, a probar. Vale. ¿Dónde estaba? Aquí. Aquí era. Sí. Hey, this fits perfectly. Tada! Problem solved. The machine is off. Yeah, I have to talk with the guy that sold it to us. I heard the problem we had is a problem with the bottle. ¿Quién está hablando? Este. Máquina soldadora. Mm. Circuito y una caja de herramientas. Pues nos necesitamos esa máquina. La máquina soldadora. Hi. Hey. Hey, Tony, I haven't seen you in a while. And who are those kids? Oh, they are Vinny and Nick. Hello. Guys, this is Alberto. What are you up to? 
were you able to descramble the pay-per-view cable signal? Well, about that, we ended up catching a distress call from an alien creature. <laughs> Man, <laughs> they really must put way to dumb videos there. No, like, really. We contacted an alien. He's in a truck outside of town. You can come and see it yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you were up to, but I'm not playing along. I have a shit ton of work to do. This place is falling to pieces. Can you lend us a tin welder? Let me think about it. No. I have a lot of work to do. Unless... Let's do something. You help me, I help you. What do you need to fix? Could you clean those circuits? They are rusted to hell piece of cake. Where is the rust remover? Oh, <laughs> that's the thing. Uh, I don't have any. Then how do you expect me to? You will find a way. You are pretty resourceful. Like that guy from TV, uh, MacGyver. We will see what we can do. Ahora esto sirve la lemon cola, que decías que podía quitar el óxido. What would you do if we had to fix a robot alien that had been shot? Well, the first thing I would do would be to stop drinking whatever I was drinking. Goodbye. Later. Vale, entonces está claro que necesitamos la lata y la lata la está bebiendo el director, así que necesitamos convencerlo para que vaya eh, para que beba la lata y se largue de ahí. May I play this? I would advise you not to touch it. This machine seems to work fine. Wait a minute. The girl of this game is undressing? An adult game? Rad! Is this broken? Not really. <laughs> It would look nice in my room, but he is not going to let me take it. You're right, I won't. It is a nice, safe game for little kids. No, it is not. <laughs> it's the second time in a week that it flung a kid after starting to spin at turbo speed. Maybe exchanging the original motor with a replacement from that Chinese antique store wasn't the best idea. Man, this is painful to watch. Don't worry, they'll be working again soon. <laughs> it's broken. Can you fix it? Maybe. What is wrong with this one? A raccoon nested in there. Then, I can't. Raccoons are little fluffy balls of evil. Vale. Yo creo que ahora sí he ido a todas partes. ¿Cómo puedo convencer a este tío para para que se vaya? Hello. Why don't you go and talk to Mrs. Perez? I would. Wasn't the alcohol supposed to be just? No. Bye. Goodbye. Algo tenemos que aprender que luego se lo decimos y se convence. It's empty, but it still smells like gas. 
Oh, I love that smell. It seems like this fryer has been used too many times. Otra cosa es intentar que se vaya el lobo que está aquí. I can't connect. What? No, no tenía sentido, pero por probar. I should refill this with the actual gas. The bottom of Red, let's go. Never. Maybe there's enough. Well, in fact, I heard that the North Forest urban design is so badly planned that they. Conectándolo really con el desagüe municipal. Vale. ¿Dónde está el desagüe municipal? The Serpentine River is the border between North Forest and South Plains. But we live on the good side of the river. Ah, espera, que se puede seguir. <laughs> no había seguido. Do you think it's referring to the aliens? No, probably some teenager with too much free time. Where the hell are we going? I have no idea. This is a maze. Who touched me? It wasn't me! It wasn't me either! It's so easy to get lost here. Let's turn here. A ver si llegamos al pozo. Follow me! I have an idea! Are you sure we're not going to end up going backwards? Yes! And we are no. back at the beginning! It's so easy to lose orientation here. Maybe if we were following a trail. Yendo un rastro. Hay que tirar algo por el pozo. Algún líquido. La sangre, quizás. Para eso sirve la sangre que está. Pero claro, está el lobo en medio. No. Hello, Mr. Wolf. Are you hungry? I bet he's hungry. Apuesto a que tiene hambre. Necesito algo que darle de comer. Quizá en la casa del director. Pero claro, no nos deja entrar. That will get us put in detention for the rest of our lives. It's not like that. This isn't pointing towards the sky, that's for sure. May I? Nope. May I? Nope. Vale, 
Vale, voy a ir a la tienda, que es... Me fui antes de hablar con el vendedor y antes de mirarlo todo. The door's cerrada. That doesn't. Hello. Ketchornia. What movie would you recommend? Do you like uh, East Cordelavia cinema? I've never seen an East Cordelavia movie. Do you like sad movies? No. Do you like violin music that uh, change pitch? No. Do you like movies about how strong and righteous is General Karnachik? Not really. Then you're not going to like East Cordelavia cinema. You talk weird. I learn English. I come from East Cordelavia. Little country, good food, beautiful women, many communism. I'm Morberto. Morberto learned fast. In East Cordelavia, I computer Karnacht. What? Da, I computer doctor. I made program dictionary on computer to learn English. Many effective. Interesting. Where is East Cordelavia? East Cordelavia, lovely country in between uh, Karmanistajan and Korcholavia, Democratic Republic. I don't know any of those countries. We know. You are not that bright in geography. Excuse me? Can you lend us your computer? No, I need to patent invention in computer. America great. America private property. How much for copying your dictionary program to a diskette? First patent, then sale. But we are in need. Morberto traveled many kilometers and crossed many fences to be convinced by communist bullshit. We want to rent a movie. Good. Vale, de todas formas, sin dinero. Okay, Nick, surprise me. I would like to rent the Sex Fist Club. Ooh, a challenge movie. <laughs> it's a short movie, but uh, your choice. Almost forgot. Show me your Radovinko. What? Your Radovinko. Identification. Show me identification. Challenge section, far away. Don't want to lose time. No identification, no challenge movies. Oh, yes! My ID. Give me a minute. Servirá el carnet de seguridad. This is you. Yes. Look different. I shaved my mustache. Mustache. Ah, Carcania, mustache. Okay then, you are a dope person. You can rent a Lunja movie. Then we want to rent the Sex Fist Club. Sure, give me a minute. This is huge. No way we can steal it. Can you at least get some useful information from it? Well, it has a dictionary installed and a movie database. I could extract it with a floppy disk. Necesito un disco. The doors. Hemos avanzado algo. The light is on. 
She must be up. We should find a way to get her attention. I don't see the point. Why would we want her attention? She's cool. I'm sure she's going to help us. It's just because you like her, right? Shut up! It's clearly out of reach. We have to find a way to get her attention. I can throw stones. No, I... Vale, esto ya lo vimos. Y algo me dice... Que el osito... Bah, el oso. ¿Y cómo recojo el oso de aquí? It reads... Claw Claw Joy 4000. Jackpot! It has... It's an... Errors. That does... Yo creo que hay que hacer algo antes. Siempre se cae. Using a rubber coated oven mitt. What? A ver, tampoco he hablado con Linda, por ejemplo, no he hablado. A lo mejor me dice algo. Hey. Yes. Any idea how big the North Forest facility is? It's pretty big. They were building something important here. The security was much higher in this place. Any idea what they were building? No, they're aliens. I don't understand most of the things they do. But something I'm sure of, what they're building isn't good. At least, not for us. What else do you know about the aliens? They arrived on our planet no more than seven years ago. They don't use spaceships to travel. At least, not anymore. And these are their main headquarters. Why do you think it's not a good idea to call the police? I know for sure that they have some of their people inside the police force. And that they can track calls with incredible precision. Alerting the police will only work against us. Do you think we could stop them? Well, it seems like your friend is a one-man army. If we can fix Ralph, then we have a good chance there. By the way, is the bull single? What kind of question is that? I'm a reporter. I ask questions. Why don't you ask him? Forget it. We'll talk later. Sure. Hey. What's up? Do you think we can defeat them? Well, maybe. We don't know how many of them there are. A lot. Then we will have to make every bullet count. Do you know where we can get some gas? At the gas station? There are no gas stations near here. What a shitty town. Do you have some in the motorcycle? And leave Anetta thirsty? That's not an option. But... That's not an option. Can you lend us some weapons? No. But we are fighting invading aliens here! No. But Vidya and Nick already used one, and with positive results. 
I don't care. Kids and guns are a terrible combination. Do you know how I lost an eye? A kid with a gun? No, it was a kid with a parrot. Just imagine if he had a gun. How are we supposed to fight the aliens if we don't have any weapons? Do your thing. Fix that metal guy. Learn about our enemy. And leave the dirty work to me. You are smart kids. You don't need to be involved in physical confrontation to win a battle. Sometimes you sound so wise. I know. I stole that line from a comic book. Any useful advice? Like what? I don't know. Enlighten us with your experience. Okay, here goes. Some words of wisdom. It's easier to shave with warm water. Never take hostages. Believe me, they'll only give you trouble. Do not trust people from Tukumon. They look naive, but they're all scoundrels. Few things are better than kicking your enemy while they're down. And lastly, if you like a girl, don't talk to her. Women prefer listeners to talkers. Besides, if you ignore them, you attract their attention. Excuse me? That's the worst piece of advice I have ever heard. I'm not talking to you. She may look angry, but it's working. You just have to wait. We'll talk later. Take care of yourself. Vale, pues vamos a hablar con Linda a ver si nos dice algo diferente. Yes. We'll talk later. Sure. Estos consejos que nos ha dado sirven de algo para el director. Hello. Why don't you go and uh, wasn't yeah just. Yeah, no. Why don't you go? Uh, wasn't the. Yeah, just. Last, but. Oh, uh, hi! Bye, goodbye! No hay nada nuevo. Aquí tampoco es que haya mirado mucho. This is really impractical to carry around. Shouldn't these tires be inside the junkyard? Who the hell puts a clothes sign on a junkyard? It is fixed to the gate. It makes no sense. Well, if the gates are closed, then you can read the sign, and it's closed. These are some heavy chains. There is no way to sneak in. Vale, para eso sirve el corta cadenas que hemos visto en la sala de videojuegos. It's pretty self-explanatory. It's a warning sign about the dog, but it looks really old. The dog is probably already dead. But what if Cujo's inside? <laughs> Cujo. Want to see some real scares? You have to see the 1941's The Wolfman. That monster looks like shit. You look like shit. The Wolfman is much more than just the look of the monster. I can see a spool of solder wire behind the mesh. Vale. I can't cut the wire mesh with my bare hands. Pues entonces será para esto, para lo que sirve el corta cadena.
Vale, hay un montón de cosas que me faltan por hacer, pero no sé cómo. En el pozo hay que tirar algo, algo que tenga olor o, o un color o un olor para poder seguirlo desde, desde aquí. Creo que a Samantha hay que traerla con el, los osos de peluche, me parece. Necesito un disquet para copiar el diccionario. Necesito convencer al director que vaya a... A la ver a la señorita, ¿cómo llamaba? ¿López? No me acuerdo. Necesito la clave para pasar... Por aquí, la clave para llegar al escondite de los muchachos perdidos. No es una opción, ¿no? The door is locked. What a great plan. If you want to draw the attention of the police. No plushies inside. And if it's here, it must be broken. What's the problem with this one? The claw doesn't have any grip strength? On the contrary, too much grip strength. We lose all the vale. plushies in a few hours. Vale, 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 For some vale. reason, when it receives a hit on the left side, the claw starts working perfectly. And that is bad for business. Uh... The machine is off. I have to talk with the guy that sold it. Vale, estoy dando los disqueros. ¿Puede ser el truco para conseguir el peluche? Darle un golpe a la máquina. Ahí está. Le da un golpe a la máquina. Y ya tengo el peluche. It's a bear holding a floppy disk that reads, I have 360 kilobytes of love for you. That's like totally cheesy. Vale, tenemos el disque. Vamos a ir a la tienda de informática. No, la tienda de informática no, la tienda del de videoclub. Vamos a volver a pedirle la, la película. This cheesy floppy bear wouldn't do much there. Como que no. Si se suponía que era para eso. This is... Can you... Well, it has a dictionary installed and a movie date. No tiene sentido. Hay que hacer algo. It's a bear hole. This cheesy... A no ser que haya que usar primero el oso. Vamos a ver. 
Vamos a la calle de Samantha. Vamos a intentar usar el oso. A lo mejor ella se queda con el oso. Y no quiere el disque. This cheesy floppy bear wouldn't do no, much there. Pues nada, pues no sé. No sé qué hay que hacer. No sé. It's a bear holding a floppy disk that re The lights are off. This place is closed. Man, I miss those burgers. You can fit everyone in that car. Tiene abierto el depósito de gasolina. wagon here. A typical car for big families. The gas cap is missing. Puedo usar la manguera. Okay, I put this here. Cool. Now you need to suck the hose and quickly put the hose in the gas can. Y después la lata de gasolina. Try not to swallow gas. We don't have time to go to the hospital. Lata de gasolina llena. The hose is okay. Yep. Oh, ahí se queda. Pero sigo sin saber. Bueno, la gasolina será lo que haya que echar al pozo, seguramente. Vamos al pozo. I should save this for the generator. Vale, pues no es para esto. Es lo que hay que echar ahí. This. La gasolina es para el generador. Que lo hemos visto antes en el. En el camión. This thing is full of gas and ready to go. If we are going to use the computer, at least we have somewhere to plug it in. The drawer is closed. Could you please stop touching everything? It's impolite. Vale, vamos a ir al camión. Aquí, sí. Y por aquí no habíamos ido todavía. El camión lleno de balas. Agujeros de bala. Let me check if I can find something useful in the cab. Did you find anything? Yeah. Some weapons? No, a flashlight. Eh, it's better than nothing. Bueno, es mejor que nada. Vale, necesitamos las monedas. Vale, vamos a ir, vamos a ir a la calle del director. Vamos a ver si convencemos a este de alguna manera. Para que termine de beber la lata y se vaya. Pero claro, también tenemos que entrar en su casa. Que vemos que aquí 
hay una puerta, pero aquí también, puerta ventana. Tapete, a ver. Va a estar la llave debajo. <risa> Ahí está. There's a key under it. Classic. Yeah, es que, I heard es que a video está. game where to enter a mansion, you should do the same thing. People should not put their keys under the doormat. Vale, vamos a ver si podemos abrir la puerta. The door is closed. No. Y esta otra puerta. Voilà. Esta sí. Hello. There's no one home. This is trespassing on private property. I think we have worse things to worry about than breaking the law at this point. Besides, we already broke the law like several times and in different degrees tonight. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Vale, para acá no se puede ir. Tenemos un acuario. The aquarium has a sign that reads Flipper. I guess it's the name of the only fish that lives here. I need a fishing net to catch that fish. He's fast and slippery. Una red de pescar, pero tenemos la freidora. Ahí está. Vale, esta es la comida del lobo. Little too much to steal and kill the principal's pet fish. Humanity is in peril. Priorities. How is having this fish going to help? Come on, a dead fish? Possibilities are endless. You have no idea, do you? Maybe, but we keep the fish. This bookshelf is full of educational and management books. Starting a book now would be an unnecessary delay. And I guess there is not much information about how to stop invading aliens on that bookshelf. I just want to... Nope, no hidden door there. Vale, estaba buscando una puerta secreta en la biblioteca. The printer has some paper jammed on it. Why do they always do that? I bet it's a conspiracy. There is no way to fix this junk. No, no hace nada. Oh boy, oh boy! Do you think this one has a dictionary installed? Tenemos el ordenador. I don't know. We should try this on the truck. We don't want to install anything weird in Ralph. It's an old typewriter. It's not as practical as a computer, but it has its charms. It's an old model, so it's unnecessarily heavy. Let me check this. Seems like Principal Smith was writing his memoirs. So he and Mrs. Perez had some kind of really weird affair? Yuck. Let's read just a couple of lines. Clara Perez and I were meant to be together. Maybe she wasn't interested in snails, and she didn't like to talk about schedules or tax refunds as much as me. But we had so much fun watching horror movies together. It was so wonderful to see her laugh every time the screen was filled with blood. And after every movie, she used the dress as a... Oh my god, Mrs. <laughs> Perez is sick! Is the principal planning on publishing this? I guess we should stop reading. That's a lot of paperwork. Man, it makes me want to puke. Come on, it's not that much. It's a lot to read about. Maybe we can find something about us, or even give ourselves good grades. Killer aliens from outer space. Let's not forget the focus. 
It's just school-related paperwork. We definitely don't need that. Okay, if we're not gonna steal it, at least let me mess it up a bit. Done. I didn't know the principal liked this kind of violent movie. So he has a cool side. This poster is okay where it is right now. Say hello to my little friend! I think this leads to the hallway. I wonder if... Yikes! Keep that door closed. I will! Vale, pues ya está. Tenemos el pescado que va para el lobo. Y hemos descubierto algo del noviazgo del director con la señorita Pérez. Así que vamos a volver a preguntarle. Hello. Why don't you go and talk to Mrs. Perez? I wouldn't know what to tell her. Wasn't the alcohol supposed to help you with that? Yeah, but... I mean... Why would she give me another chance? Just give me a reason and I'll finish this beer and go straight to her door. Ahí está. Esto es nuevo. Ella debería darle otra oportunidad porque a usted le gustan las películas de terror tanto como a ella. She should give you another chance because you like horror movies as much as she does. Hey. That's a great point. We really enjoyed watching horror movies together late at night. She always was a bit jealous of the... Uh, she always was a bit jealous of that vampire show host. The one with the big boobs? Yeah, that one! Love for horror movies. Hope it works. Clarita, here we go! Vale, pues ya tenemos la lata. Is it empty? Yeah, but it could be handy. Esta lata hay que dársela a las chicas para que no la cambie por una lemon cola. I want to trade this can for some Super Lemon Cola, please. Ready for the Super Lemon Cola Trader Garbage Challenge? Oh wait, this can is empty. Uh, according to the Super Lemon Cola Trader Garbage Challenge rules point F in size F, only cans with liquid inside can be used for the Super Lemon Cola Trader Garbage Challenge. Sorry, take your can back. Qué caprichosa, ahora que ya ganarla de algo, de lo que sea, pues aquí hay agua. O aquí, bueno, ya que... Ya que voy a ir aquí al, al lobo, había sangre a lo mejor. Esta sangre azul me vale. Hala, toma el pescado. Líquido azul, ¿valdrá? An empty beer isn't going to accomplish no. much there. No vale. Bueno, ya que estoy aquí, a ver qué hay por aquí. That's a lot of waste. Desechos tóxicos. And according to the gay guard counter, this waste is radioactive. The kind of radioactivity that gives you superpowers or the kind of radioactivity that mutates you? The kind of radioactivity that increases your chances of developing cancer if you are exposed to it over long periods of time. Una barra. Barra de. Is it safe to handle? According to the Gagar counter, this thing is highly radioactive. Pues sí. Una barra Even de uranio. If it could contaminate a small water supply, but it's not like this thing is going to melt your hand if you touch it. Just be sure we don't hold on to it for more than a few hours. I feel like I'm in an RPG. But instead of increasing my chances of dealing critical damage, I increase my chances of developing cancer. Va. 
Vale, eh, voy a ir a ver si tirando la barra de uranio al pozo es lo que necesito para seguir el rastro. A lo mejor... Ahí está, la ha tirado. Ahora voy a ir aquí, ya que estoy aquí voy a intentar llenar la lata de agua. Sí. Ya está, ¿no? Ahora tengo un full de agua de water. Ahí está el rastro. Podemos seguirlo hasta las monedas. El Jager Counter empezó a beat. Así que so, el well y estos drains fueron conectados en el final. Vamos a seguir el trail radioactivo. Turn here. It's this way. No, that way. Ow! Who hit me? It was that way in the end. Hey, it looks like we're at the bottom of the well. And it's full of arcade tokens. Let's get as many as we can. I think we have more than enough. You're right. Let's go back. Cowabunga! What the hell does that mean? Nothing. Just forget it. Vale, tenemos monedas de arcade. Ah, no son, no hay dinero. Have enough of the arcades all night. No hay dinero. Son monedas para las máquinas. Pues vamos a las máquinas. Ahora podemos retar a esta gente. Hello. What's up, South Planers? We challenge you. Did you bring your game tokens? Of course. Bring it on, South Planers. It has to be a perfect three out of three to win. Otherwise, it's just a tie. Vale, lo que hay que hacer aquí es dejar que ellos elijan primero. Ahí está. Y encontrar cuál es el el guerrero, el luchador que vence a este. Por ejemplo, en este caso, el que vence a este es... Vamos a probar con este. That character you're using does not belong to this game at all. You can turn Altered Wolf into a bear? How do you do that? I won. My calculations yeah, were correct. Come on, it was just luck. Well done. Okay, I'm next. This will be a piece of cake. Y ahora lo mismo, a ver, esperar a que elija. Vale, y este le gana. I have no idea what I'm doing, but my character looks hot. Maybe this guy isn't a fighter, but he is smart. Yeah, I'm the best. Uh, the buttons were jamming. Well done, Nick. Seems like I'm the final boss. Let's fight. Vale, y a este le gana este. Are you going to try to defeat me with Bimmy Dragon? Really? I feel bad about punching such a lovely character. Yes! That was pure luck! We won! Now, hand me your game tickets. A bet is a bet. You know, you taught us a lesson. Maybe people from South Plains aren't so stupid after all. Thank you. Yeah, maybe if we... No, I can't do this. I think you are stupid and you won because you were lucky. 
South Plain sucks! Really? And stop stealing our parents' jobs! That was weird. Vale, ahora con los tickets. Puedo cambiarlo por la, los alicates. Let me see that. For this, I can give you a pair of end cutters. Is that okay? Lo, lo Is hay. there any other thing we could trade the tickets for? Not really. Then I guess it's okay. Here you go. Vale, y los alicates ya hemos visto que había que ir aquí al, al depósito de chatarra. What if a dog bites me when I reach for the solder wire? Oh, shut up. Okay, now we have 10 solder wire. Awesome! Y ya tenemos el estaño. Nos falta el soldador, pero el soldador lo conseguíamos. Primero tenemos que necesitamos la lemon cola. Que nos decían que podía des, eh, era desoxidante, así que. I want to trade this for some super lemon cola, please. Ready for the super lemon cola trader garbage challenge? Yes! Take your brand new super lemon cola can. Legal disclaimer, the can you're taking may or may not be brand new. Thanks! You are welcome. Legal disclaimer, you may or may not be welcome. Vale, y ahora volvemos otra vez hasta aquí y vamos a quitarle el óxido de la placa de, de juego. Brad. I knew this was abrasive, but didn't expect results so quick. Hey, thanks. That's formidable work. And with a nice lemon smell. You help me, now I help you. You can use my tin welder. Sadly, I don't have any soldering tin left. But don't worry, it's pretty cheap. Tomorrow you can go to the hardware store and get some. Bueno, ya tenemos el soldador, el estaño, Awesome. El ordenador. Do you have any tin to lend us? Si te he dicho que no. No, uh, not really. Te acabo de decir que no tiene. Que nos falta, nos falta quitarle el disquete del oso y hacer una copia del del diccionario. Vale, ¿qué tenemos nuevo? Tenemos la linterna que no la hemos usado aún. ¿Y qué más falta por hacer? Entrar aquí en la instalación abandonada. Ah, lo de Samantha. He intentado tirarle el oso, pero el oso no sirve. Llamarle la atención con la linterna. Sí. Steve, ¿es that you? Who is Steve? Vinny, what are you doing here? You know what time it is? It's a long story. May we enter your house? It's kind of cold out here. Uh, okay. It won't be the first time that I sneak three guys into my room. What? Oh, forget it. Give me a minute. Now climb! Why does she have a rope ladder ready? Don't ask. The answer will probably break Vinny's heart. Vale, a ver, ¿qué tenemos por aquí? Animales de peluche, pero yo ya tengo uno. 
Wow, she has a lot of plush toys. Some of them are really weird. Look at that smiling thing with a hat. I guess that's a character from a game that is announced to be released next year. Too weird for me. Son todos iguales. Tijeras. I should... Please, let that be. But what if we need to cut something? If you need something cut, I'll cut it myself. But don't touch my heirloom scissors. Intento separar, a ver. <laughs> you need something cut? Let me do this for you. We want to remove the disket. And done. Vale, ahora sí. Sigo teniendo el oso. It's just a plush bear. I could leave the bear there. No. But maybe I could give it a better use. It seems like girls just want to have fun in the end. Oh, don't turn that on. I'm watching TV. My pompadour is welcome. I always look good. I must admit, we look pretty fresh for three guys that just escaped an alien lab. Oh, can you please stop touching everything? <laughs> I would have never believed I would say that in my room. It's a set of probably line makeup. That's a lot of makeup. You should have seen my previous makeup set. I had the whole Red Summer Probably Line lipstick collection. But I had to throw it out after I learned that the whole Red Summer collection was highly toxic to people allergic to peanuts. I didn't know you were allergic to peanuts. I'm not, but some of the members of the football team are. Eh, teníamos... No, no tenemos nada aquí. This is some kind of bread. It's sufgani oat. I made it myself. They're delicious. I can't talk to that. May we take one? Sure. They are... They are delicious! Right? Sometimes you gotta take a bullet for the team. What? Nothing. I mean, uh, these things are delicious, right, Tony? Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Oh, I'm really glad you liked it. I can make more for you tomorrow, if you wish. No! I don't want to cause any trouble. No es tan tan bueno. Esto no ha servido de nada. Si se hubiera quedado alguno, todavía. Look at these guys trying to look cool. John, John, Bobby. How long can one of these bands last? I bet no one is going to remember them in two years. Vinny, if you keep trying to steal stuff, I will have to ask you to leave. So, what are you doing outside my home at this time of the night? Do, uh, do you believe in aliens? No. Then you're not going to believe this. What do you mean? Well, we received this weird signal, and then... Can you please focus on why you're here? We found an alien robot creature, now it's wounded, and we want to repair it. And teach him how to properly speak our language. Yeah, he only does weird noises. Like boops and beeps. You are right. I don't believe you. Why are you here this late? If we say common teenage vandalism, will you believe us? Well... Yeah. Then that's what we are doing this late at night. 
What are you doing uh, awake this late at night? Uh, just combing my hair. Also, Steve was supposed to come watch MTV and chill. Who the hell is Steve? Steve Carson? Isn't that guy, like, five years older than you? And he's an asshole. That's none of your business. I totally agree. It is... now I... well... Uh, do you... I mean... What? Nothing. Ah, no se lo ha pedido. Pues mucho mejor. Mejor que no se lo pida. Can you help us? With your little green men from Mars? He is really tall. Definitely not green. And I doubt he is from Mars. If you're trying to impress me, this is definitely not working. See you later. Bye bye. Look at those guys. Oh, old stuff is so much better. What happened to Glenn Miller? He died 40 years ago. The TV is tuned to some music TV station. Those video clips make no sense. Why the eye patch? Why the kimono? Why the spinning? Well, actually, that's the only thing that makes sense. He is spinning like a record. The door is closed. And if my dad finds out you're here, he's going to kill you all. So it will be better if it stays closed. We can all agree to leave the door closed. Pues aquí no he hecho nada, aparte de comerme el pan. Ah, bueno, sí, cortar, es verdad, cortar el disquete. Pues el disquete ahora sí va a servir para hacer la copia del diccionario. I used my is no. Hello. Chichornia. Eh, alquilar una película. Good. What movie you want? You always want to see old movies. Let me choose something better. No, no, no. This is my turn. It was Vinny. Nick, Tony. Last week it was Nick's turn. Now it's my turn. Okay, Nick. Surprise me. I would like to rent the Sex Fist Club. Oh, Jalonska movie. I already seen your ID. Let me go for that movie and deposit. Wait a minute. Y ahora sí. Good idea. Cover me. And done. I copied all the dictionary files onto this floppy disk. Y ahora ya nos podemos ir. Antes de que vuelva. Vale, ya tenemos. Tenemos el ordenador. Y tenemos el disco. Y tenemos el soldador y el estaño. Y ya le hemos puesto al generador eh, gasolina, así que a ver. I don't think I could connect a Commodore 64 there. No, ahí no. By the way, how are you supposed to make this compatible with Ralph? Alien technology. And that's all the explanation I need to hear. Ahí estamos. This computer does not have any kind of dictionary installed. So? So, we should install a dictionary in this computer before connecting it to our metallic friend. Vale, hay que repararlo. Eh, estaño. I need to use this with a welding machine. 
It's not like I can magically melt the tin. Vale, 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 vale. Hay que usar el estaño. That's more like it. Ah, ahí está. Ahora tenemos estaño y soldadura y el y el soldador juntos. Y ahora sí lo arregla. You think you can fix them? I guess so. The circuits seem to be pretty basic. Let me give it a try. I think he is better now. Wow, you're a genius! I know. Me falta instalar el disquet en el ordenador. Yeah, it doesn't fit. No encaja. We should install a floppy drive first. Vale, falta. We should connect this to route. Not only that. How sí, sí. Esto ya lo hemos visto. Falta una unidad de disquet. Vale, ahora voy a ir a Costa del Río y voy a utilizar la linterna con la sombra del cocodrilo. There you are, just a bunch of debris. Holy guacamole! The evil crocodile turned into debris. Thank you, goblins. With your magic, you saved me. It was an easy task. That deserves an award. Here you go. The magic wand of happiness for you. That's just old lipstick. Thank you, oh noble hobo. You are welcome, my friend. Now stop looking at my stuff or I'll cut you. Bien, ahora voy a ir a hablar con el chico que está aquí en el parque. Hey! Yeah. Have you seen something unusual? Well, I've seen a lot of stuff lately. Do you know something about repairing robot aliens? No, but I know a lot of trivia facts. Like what? Did you know that in Monkey Kong, if you hold down and start for seven seconds, then up, up, down, you get a bonus lives? It's kind of a pointless trick. Who plays that game anyways? Talking about pointless. Did you know that in Darksville Castle, there's a secret cat mode? It's pretty pointless, but some people play it anyways. Super Lemon Cola is the best soda ever. Bye! Bye, bye, bye. Vale, ya tenemos el truco de la, del juego. Vamos a ir a hablar con... Aquí está, con el cráneo de serpiente y le decimos el truco que nos acaba de, de contar el niño. What? Did you know? What? I heard that if you hold down and start for seven seconds, then up, up, down, you get bonus lives. Really? Let me give it a try. <laughs> hey, it works. Thanks. You guys are awesome. You should be part of the Lost Guys. We need more smart people like you. Go talk with Furio. He's at the abandoned factory. Tell him Snake Skull sent you. The password to enter is John Bobby Sucks. Cool. Vale, ya tenemos la clave para entrar dentro de las instalaciones abandonadas. Hi. What now? Can we pass? No, this place is Lost Guys only. But we are Lost Guys. Okay, prove it. What is the Lost Guys gang password, bozo? John Bobby sucks. It does. Who sent you? Snake Skull. Oh, that guy. He's pretty cool. Bueno, ya podemos entrar. Looks like they made a fire pit with a barrel. I dig it. Looks pretty post-apocalyptic. 
It's hot as hell. Aquí está la unidad de disquete que necesitamos. Uy, hay que hablar con todo. She looks good. She looks hot. Man, I like girls in leather. Not the best moment to start a fight. Vale. That we are clearly going to lose. Hello. Who are you? We just joined the Lost Guys. Furio told us to join in. Do you have names? Oh, yes. I'm Vinny. I'm Tony. And I'm El Toro. Nice name. Welcome to the Lost Guys. We fight the system. Yeah, down with capitalism. Long live anarchy. My name is Spike. I'm Slashy. I'm Star. And I'm Rainbow Ray. So, what are we doing here exactly? We trash the system. Listen to music. Hang out. Make out. Woo! Why did you join the Lost Guys? We... we like to do rat stuff. And make out. I mean... Forget it. How are we supposed to fight the system? Well, we listen to alternative music. Yeah, music that makes you think. And also, I bought a new jacket that says, Down the system! I drew a big anarchy A in front of the bank. Yeah, down with capitalism. But do you realize that anarchy is the ultimate expression of liberal capitalism? Where the state is so small that it has disappeared? and everyone is free to trade in any manner that individuals deem fit? What? I mean, capitalism sucks. Long live anarchy. Uh, radical. He talks kind of funny, but I like this guy. What's all that stuff over there? It's stuff we steal from our parents to sell. So we can buy cassettes, jackets, paint, Posters, bracelets, hairspray, makeup, hair extensions, lipstick, bandanas, boots, fingerless gloves, and radical stuff, like more lipstick. Why don't we just go burn some big corporation? Yeah, like the New Frontier Corporation. I like how you think, and I would love to do that, man. But I twisted my ankle, so I can't run. I can't because, um, I'm such a pyromaniac that if I start, I'll probably burn the whole town. I would join, but I'm, like, totally allergic to peanuts. And if we encounter peanuts, things could get nasty. Don't look at me. My dad doesn't let me burn stuff. Vale, este es alérgico a los cacahuetes. Y ella se ha pintado los labios y le ha dado un beso. Y nosotros tenemos un pintalabios que está hecho con, con mantequilla de cacahuete, así que... O con aceite de cacahuete, no sé lo que decía exactamente. See you later. Red. Red Summer Probably Line Lipstick Number 9. It reads, because you're Mantequilla de cacahuete. And on the back it reads... Ingredients. Sulfactant, anti-static emolument, peanut butter, and red dye number two. A ver si le doy el lápiz a ella. I have something for you. Thanks. I love the color, but I'm not going to kiss you. Not in front of Spikes. Vamos a esperar a ver si le besa. O oh, tengo que hablar con ellos otra vez. Vamos a probar otra vez a ver. So, hey, hello. Hey, welcome to the Lost Boys Hideout. So, what are we doing here exactly? 
We trash the system. Listen to music. Hang out. Make out. Ahí está. <coughs> es alérgico, se ha hinchado. Se le hincha toda la cara. ¡Wow! Ahora nos podemos llevar la unidad de disquete sin que nadie se entere. One sí. less thing to worry about. What if the guy dies from an allergy? A new thing to worry about. Vale, ya tenemos el disquete. Bueno, la unidad de disco, el disquete también lo tenemos. was easy to install. Now we can use floppy disks in the computer. Let me install this. And done. Hello. I acknowledge your existence. What are you? Unable to find specific definition in dictionary. Any approximation? Extraterrestrial being. We already knew that. Could you be more specific? I, extraterrestrial soldier. Are you a robot? Robot machine programmed to move and perform tasks automatically. I no robot. You see, he can't be named Ralph since he is not a robot alien life form. I like Ralph name. Sawan's musical. He likes it, bro. He can't argue with that. Why are you here? We at war, blue blood enemy. Why are you at war? We could pay back. Can you elaborate? Give him a break. He just learned how to speak our language. I bet explaining the political reasons behind intergalactic warfare is incredibly complex. Come on, how hard could it be to explain a conflict? Could you elaborate in simple terms the reasons behind the Falklands War? Shut up. What are the Blue Blood doing here? Blue Blood developing walking technology on planet Earth. Blue Blood future plans. Planet Earth walks. Planet Earth becomes weapon. Planet Earth destroy Ralph Planet. I didn't get a thing. It seems like... The blue-blooded guys are deploying some kind of warping technology to weaponize our planet. Like making a Death Star? No, I think they are planning to teleport Earth into Ralph's world, destroying both planets in a really efficient way. Correct. They working now. Priority. Stop blue blood. Why would they choose to use Earth as a weapon? Good size. Good distance, ideal working conditions. But the planet has people on it. Isn't that a problem? Opposite, humans primitive civilization. Humans does not suspect humans help. Why do the blue blood look like humans and you look so different? Blue blood humans, same creator, similar principles, Ralph humans, different creator, different principles. Wow. So gods exist? He isn't talking about gods, necessarily. Who created us? Who created you? 
long to explain, hard to explain, little time, priority, stop blue blood. Vale, ¿y ahora qué? Stop the bad guys. Not ready for battle. I require further modifications. I require metal. I require improved armor. I think I know where we can find what he wants. Are you thinking of... Let's go! Ralph ready for battle. Ralph mean bastard. I like his attitude. All right, Ralph is improved and at full power. What is our next move? Attack Blue Blood Base. Located 1.3 kilometers northeast. Threat imminent. Fast action required. I think R2 here is right. We must storm their position and quick. I not had to. I Ralph. I know, I know. So things are about to go crazy. Kids, you already did an excellent job. I mean, you repaired a robot alien for God's sake. But now is the action part. People are going to get killed. I want you to stay here with Linda. While I, in the talking microwave, go stop the bad guys. I, not microwave, I Ralph. But we want to help! Yeah, the world depends on this. Every man counts. Desperate times call for desperate measures. We should go with you. But I need you to help. Look, follow me. Check this out. Cool! What is this? This is my radio. When the time comes, I need you to put the coordinates I'm going to give you here. And then, you pull that lever. Okay? Linda could do this! We want to go with you! No, guys. I need you to protect the truck while I'm out. Besides, you're smarter than Linda. You think that we are smarter than a woman who successfully infiltrated an alien undercover organization? Uh, I need you to protect her. Stay here. Okay. Can you give us a rifle? <sighs> no. Let's go, Metal Man. It's a war that we have to unleash. I, not Metal Man. Whatever. We have work to do. The bull. Yes? Do you have enough ammo? I know. What? Uh, nothing. I thought you were about to say something different. Uh, of course I have enough ammo. Don't worry about me. Me and Monica are an unbeatable team. Uh, Monica? His shotgun? Yeah. Well, we have to go. Remember, wait for my signal. I acknowledge your existence. Now what? Oh, well, uh, the bull told me uh, you should check the truck radio. What? Yes! He will call you. Eventually. When that happens, follow his instructions. Oh, yes. Uh, we have to go do our thing. Let's go, guys. Okay, so the plan is... We enter the base through the secret elevator, and we help the bull and Rao from the inside. Are you sure we want to go directly underground? Last time we were there, we almost died. How are we going to deal with the guards? I'm sure they are going to be busy protecting their front door. I'm in. Okay, let's do this. Ni siquiera nos han dicho lo que tenemos que hacer. Some metal barrels with oil on it. The barrels are heavy, and the lid is sealed shut. These crates contain uh, something. Very insightful. I 
can't open this with my bare hands. Me neither. It's locked. Who would have guessed? Of course, we are not authorized to enter. Pero seguimos teniendo el carnet de seguridad. It's not like that cares pues about no. the security ID. All I could think about when I see one of these at the Temple of Doom. That's my least favorite Indiana movie. He should never turn evil. It's heavy, but that's the magic of wheels. Otra vez, a ver si los conductos de ventilación. Bolts are the same size. Awesome. Vale, ya estamos dentro. It's some kind of alien machine. No, I don't think so. This is just a printing machine, a big one, of course. It won't budge. Vale, van a entrar en todas las salas a través de los conductos. Bolts at the same size. Awesome. At this point, it's pretty obvious that the standard of the bolts used for the air ducts are the same size as the wrench. The air here is humid and dense, so it's normal that moss started to grow on the walls. Tony, aren't you supposed to comment something about the moss? Like the Latin name or something? You always talk about plants and stuff. It's not the Latin name, it's the scientific name. I don't like moss. Fair enough. The moss is well attached to the wall. Pegado a la pared. Puedo cortarlo? Should I? No. No, esto es lo de siempre. Y con el cardeno se puede raspar. No. Tampoco. Habitación de vigilancia, habitación de cristal. Come on, how long can it take to set this thing up? We're doing it as fast as we can, sir. There is a strider and some natives besieging the facility gates. I am aware of the situation, sir. Do we have enough substance, X? Yes, sir. As you can see, we have more than enough in the pool. The crystal is also in position. Warping was planned for tonight. I know. And this operation is crucial to win the war. Yes. If this works, we would wipe out most of the Strider population. Sir, with all due respect, successfully warping a whole planet requires a lot of work and concentration. We are doing our best here. I get it, I get it. No sé si deberíamos intentar abrir la tapa esta. That doesn't have number six no. volts. If we open this, they are going to spot us. Maybe if they were distracted? Maybe. Any plans? Nope. Vale, hay que distraerlos de alguna manera. Tenemos el monitor, pues yo supongo que habrá que distraerlos en otro sitio. There is a guard over there. Don't open the air duct, or he'll spot us. Y aquí también lo mismo. There is a guard over there. Wait a minute. Isn't he the guy we released? Ah, He's wearing a helmet. Below the armor, he is wearing the orange prisoner's jumpsuit. Hello? Who goes there? I know ah, that que no atrapado, pero no. Prisoner Costello? Who? Where? What? What are you doing here? Trying to escape. The real question is, what are you doing here? Trying to shut this base down. Is the Strider still with you? Ralph? Yes. Another reason to escape. We are not authorized to open the door. 
A ver lo que hey. nos cuenta. Yes. How did you end up here? I think the uniform speaks for himself. I mean in the space. I hijacked a train and ended up here. It wasn't easy. I almost fell in a lava pool. Some asshole blew up the train ramp. <laughs> oh, really? I can't believe it! We had nothing to do with it. Do you have any extra weapons? I don't have any weapons at all. Why do you think I'm hiding here like a rodent? Any extra uniforms? No. And besides, you are too short to pass as a guard. Any escape plans? Not really. I'm improvising. But why haven't you escaped yet? I mean, there's an elevator that can take you to the nearby woods. Really? He came through it. How far from there is the closest teleportation station? What's a teleportation station? We don't have teleportation stations. Our civilization hasn't discovered teleportation yet. Then going out isn't the escape route. At least not for me. Any idea what they have in this place? Some crates with biosamples. Enough substance X to teleport the entire planet. Some huge quantum crystals. And that asshole Admiral Rembrandt. Pues tampoco nos ha dicho mucho. Not, or at least I hope not. I'll move this one time to the right. No, eso no. El botón rojo, a ver. I will leave this in the center. Pues no sé. Voy a darle otra vez al botón rojo, a ver. Ahí está. Ah, una palanca. Ha saltado una palanca. Pues tendremos que llegar ahí. Ok, let's see. What number should I dial? Acceso remoto al ordenador. Este lo sabrá, ¿no? Hey. Yes. Todo es igual. Sí. Not. Oh. The description on the machine reads Terminal 314. Vale, podemos poner ese número aquí. Okay, let's see. What number should I dial? Let me try something. What are you doing? Leaving them a little distraction. <laughs> Nothing fancy, but I guess it would do the trick. Why can't we restore communications? What the hell is this? It seems like what we are watching is... Adult pay-per-view cable, sir. What else could go wrong today? Vale, vamos a volver. A ver si se han ido. Pero están distraídos. A lo mejor sí que podemos abrir ahora el conducto. That doesn't happen. Los alicates. Should I? No, tampoco. Okay, they seem pretty distracted. No hace falta nada para abrir. I do this gently. Done. We are really high. Don't worry. No one is planning to jump. No one. No one. 
Hay que echar algo dentro del estanque. ¿Los huevos de alien? I'd rather not. No. Pues no sé qué echarle. According to what that guy said, this is a pool full of substance X. I just hope they don't see us or we are screwed. El musgo. Habrá que sacar el musgo de alguna manera. I could leave the bear there, but me. No. I. I. It's a head. Some metal barrels with oil on them. The barrels are head. Vale, pesada. The door won't budge. It won't budge. Podemos volver a salir de aquí. Volver atrás no vamos a poder estar roto, vale. And I'm not hopping on one of those things ever again. We are not going back until. No, no puede volver. Nos hace falta el la barra de hierro, pero ¿cómo? Naked. Let's see what we got here. This activates the anti-air lasers of the turrets. Okay, I'll move this one time to the left. I'll move this one time to the right. Vale, ahí vemos que hay un conducto enorme y hemos visto uno antes. Aquí. ¿Podremos subir por el conducto de ventilación? It's not possible to climb through the tube. All the humidity makes it really slippery. Podemos hablar con ellos que nos tienen el. el. Sí, ya verás. Kids, the ball. What the hell are you doing down there? We found a way to sneak in. This wasn't the plan. Are you all right? Don't worry about us. We got this. Vale, no, nos va a tirar por el conducto, nos va a tirar la barra de hierro. Uh, how can we help you? By going back to the truck. That's not an option. Then try not to get killed. We are trying as hard as we can. Why don't you blow up the floor and come down here? Can you do that? No main structure ever leave me in boss. We can't. Can you give us some weapons? We already talked about this. The answer is still no. But we're already inside. 
You are only going to harm yourself. There should be a crowbar there. Can you throw it down the pipe? Sure. Wait a minute. How did you know that? We saw it through some surveillance cameras. That makes sense. But if you are starting to develop psychic powers, you should tell me. If we do, you are going to be the first one to know. Open. No, no podemos. Pero sí que podemos, seguramente, abrir los barriles. We can't. No. Y las. A ver, ¿dónde estaba? Y las cajas que estaban aquí. Let's see what kind of alien technology they are hiding here. That's just corn seeds. And pretty regular corn. I will get some seeds. Why not? What if we need to do popcorn, right? Vale, vamos a... Tenemos... Some metal barrels... Aceite, tenemos Sevilla, tenemos el agente X, el... Y faltaría... A ver, ¿dónde estaba? Estancia F, X, el aceite y las y las semillas. Pues faltaría... Bueno, primero conseguir el aceite. Sabemos que está ahí, pero hay que abrirlo. Ah, mírala. La sustancia F la tenemos. Tenemos la X, la F, la semilla y falta conseguir el aceite. It's a blue plastic barrel. It's too heavy to move. And the lid... Should I? Have you ever cut... Then... No. ¿Cómo conseguimos el aceite? Y como no lo llevamos también, porque no tenemos nada con que llevarlo. Si podemos, bueno, si hay que abrir los barriles, claro. Esta máquina. I really and it's not connected to any power source. We could open it to see if it has something useful inside, but everything is screwed together. Okay, let me try. Aceite. Good idea. Tenemos el aceite, ya está todo. Vamos a ver qué pasa. A ver, y echamos la sustancia F, el aceite y las semillas. What the hell is that? No, those numbers can't be good. Estaban dentro. What the hell? Unexpected situation. We must leave this place immediately. Believe us, there is not much time to explain. There is a big chance that the ground below this area will start to collapse in the next few minutes. What are we waiting for? Leading the way. Enemy neutralized. That was close. We stopped an intergalactic threat. I... 
I feel like the guys from the Invasion of the Saucer Man. Do you realize that we might have created an ecological disaster of gargantuan proportions? I told you to wait for me at the truck. And leave you to have all the fun? Shut up. Where is Linda, by the way? I was trying to contact her, but the communications are jammed. She must be in the truck. Let's go check if she's alright. I'm not going, I leave. But we need to hide you from the authorities! Yeah, we have a treehouse where you can stay and all. I, soldier, I keep going. I would love to know more about you in the universe. But, if you have to go, we understand. Yeah. Good luck, Ralph. Was a pleasure to work with you. You got really good aim. I acknowledge your existence. We acknowledge your existence, too. Man, Linda was so mad when we got back. If you think about it, no one ever thanked us for saving the world. I know, right? Well, officially we weren't even there, and it was a terrorist attack. I still can't believe everyone in town bought the sorry-ass excuse they made up to have us and our family quarantined. I was talking with some people, and this might be pure speculation, but it seems like the government found and shut down a third base during the 90s. Really? Yeah. Wow. Did you see anything related to, you know, Striders? Not a word. But then again, I work in the DEA. The only aliens we see are usually illegal aliens. <laughs> Anyways, what about you, Doc? Any progress replicating the thing? What? The thing that made the vegetation go crazy. Essence something. You mean Substance F? Yes. There is no way to replicate that thing. However, we are working on a prototype that increases the growth speed of tomatoes by 70%. Wow, that's crazy! So you can have a tomato ready to harvest in like two days? You never grow tomatoes, do you? Vinny? What's on your mind? Eh, nothing. Just watching you two. Seems like the Mystery Stalkers will never change. Who are the Mystery Stalkers? That was our group name! Don't you remember? We used to call ourselves that. We never ever called ourselves that. Yeah, we did! No, we didn't. You tried to make it a thing for a week or something, but it never caught on. You can deny it, but it was our name. It's stupid. It was our group name! It wasn't. It was. Hey, look at the time. We're going to be late! Let's go. Kids, I'm so happy you came to visit me. We're glad to see you too, old man. Can you at least pause the game? Yes, after I beat this level. Did you smuggle what I told you? Yep, three bottles of whiskey. Good. By the way, one of the nurses is very impressed with you. She told me she sees all your videos. Cool! Your channel is the Mad Retro Reviewer, right? Yep. She is a big fan of 50s movies and 80s video games. And she has a huge pair of them. I'm a married man. I won't tell Rebecca. I'll pass. This game is so unfair. You should use a different elemental. Wanna give it a try? Let me do it! <sighs> what the hell is that? Oh, that. He started it. He was stealing my oatmeal. Some things never change. Elizabeth Falco, what did I tell you? But, Dad! What did I tell you? That... I'm grounded? Exactly! And that means no TV, no radio, and no video games! That's so unfair! I used to think the same, but it's for your own good. So 
someone's chucking rocks at my window. I guess it's Barbara or Soul. Probably Barbara. I always had a thing for the past. I grew up watching old black and white movies when I was a kid. Particularly ones made in the 40s. I mean, I still watch them, even now. Probably it has something to do with experiencing a decade I was never a part of by consuming what people at that time consumed. An age that my grandparents and parents loved and that I admired. Looking back now, I would have to say the best decade of all had to be the 80s. It's not about the music, even if it was the best music ever made. And it's not about the video games either, even though they were amazing and they shaped the games that kids play today. It is not that the world was free of problems and conflict. <laughs> In fact, we lived through an alien invasion during that decade. Fact is, for me and my friends, things were simple. It was an age of discovery. The world smelled brand new and everyone was alive. I understand that this is completely subjective, but I'm sure I'm not the only one. To all the 80s lovers, salute!